hello everybody in this video we are going to discuss about the page fault so whenever we talk or discuss about the concept of demand paging obviously we are encountering with the term called page fault now what exactly is this page fault so whenever the process is going trying to access the page which is not swapped on to the main memory then the page fault is going to occur okay so now the question arises what are the reasons for the page fault to occur so there can be two reasons basically the first one is it might be the failure of the operating system which is not able to bring the valid page onto the main memory or due to the invalid address error okay so the next question is how to handle this kind of page faults so i have tried to explain the handling of the page fault with the help of a diagram so let us see that so there are certain steps if you wanted to handle the page fault so here as you can see this is the diagram and here i have given certain steps okay these are the numbers or this is the sequence in which we are going to handle the page fault so initially what happens is whenever we are loading the program onto the uh, cpu for processing purpose the first thing what the cpu is going to do is it is going to check for the memory reference of the page that means it is going to check the page table for the particular page and in the page table if whatever the memory reference is given if that page is invalid then the operating system is going to terminate the process otherwise if the reference is valid but the page is not swapped in that means page fault is occurring and now it is a task of the operating system to check the page or the requested page on the disk that's why the third step is page on the disk so it is going to check for the required page on the disk and once it is found that missing page is brought into the physical memory okay and once the music, uh, missing page is brought into the physical memory the immediate thing what we are going to do is reset the page table resetting the page table that means we are going to change the status of the page table that means we are making it as valid bit that means the requested page is loaded on to the physical memory and once it is loaded the cpu is going to restart the instruction that means it is going to start with the execution process so this is the way in which we are able to handle the page fault hope you people have understood this concept of page fault thanks